Tornado victims in Watford City have salvaged what belongings they could find, which in many cases may not have been much. But now it's time to clean up the mess left behind. Daniela Hurtado reports from the RV park where more than 100 homes were destroyed, dozens of people injured, and a newborn baby killed. More than 120 volunteers out here at Prairie View RV Park picking up the debris that was left by the big tornado yesterday in Watford City. Now they say the most important part of today's job is helping find the belongings of those victims. And the pickup begins after the 127 mile per hour tornado destroyed many people's homes and left dozens injured. We've had an overabundance of help from the community. Um, over 45 local companies have donated employees and labor to come and help equipment. And so to utilize that once we clear an area of personal property, we're allowing some debris to be removed. And as you can expect, there's a lot of it. It's kind of tough to tell on exactly how long you know this process is going to take. Our main concern is, is the safety inside the park and the safety for these pieces of heavy equipment. Williamson says the property is trying to figure out what insurance will cover. He says they don't know if FEMA will be involved or if the area will be declared emergency by the state. They say this operation is going to take a very long time. It's not going to be a day, a week, a few weeks. They say it could even take a few months to get back to complete normalcy. In Watford City, Daniela Hurtado, NBC North Dakota News.